This is P.P. Douglas, my non-hardcore, non-ultimate, non-Iron Man, non-region locked, non-tile locked, normal ass guy. And I want a quest point cape. Hello, Jacob. Hello, it's me. I'm Jacob. Hello, Mike. And I'm also Jacob. No, you're not. No, no that's wrong. Okay, you, uh... can be Jacob. you be Jacob and I'll be Mike. Okay. We're here with a very special series. This is RuneScape, baby. We're doing it. Um, Jacob, doing? Jacob had to be here because it's his fault that I fell into RuneScape hard for the past, like, three months and I played like an insane amount of RuneScape um, and what we're gonna do is we I've assembled an elite crew and we're gonna tackle the hardest quests in the game my goal is to get a quest point cape and I, I think looking at rune light here there's three quests remain and all of them are the hardest quests in the game so we're gonna start with sins of the father and this is gonna be really easy I bet that's not hard at all you only have to kill like 100 bosses and do a billion different things um so yeah let's let's do it man simple enough now, two important things for the viewers to know. Oh, yeah, One, Zay is not kidding when he says he fell in hard, because when we were recording Miles Morales, I don't know, in December, I think? It was a while uh, we, we talk about you playing RuneScape in that show, and that was a long time ago. Yeah, my recollection of that is you said we're going to be done playing RuneScape in a few weeks or something, right? And I'm like, I'm not so sure about that. Because I would already right. was like, I'm into this. Uh, this game's good is the thing. Um, and well, that's that, the thing about that this leads game. In, it actually kicks ass. It's like the best game ever. That leads into the second thing, which is that the viewers need to know, you've played a lot of RuneScape. Yeah. Here's my skills if you want. If anyone wants to take a, a glance. If, if you know anything about RuneScape, these are all... Holy moly. Pretty Look high. <laughs> um, actually... You're the cracked out gamer. We were planning to do this actually... Uh, like last weekend, but then I didn't feel good and didn't want to to do this specific quest. And I think since then, almost all of my combat skills have gone up like at least five levels because I got Slayer up a bunch. So I've been I've been ripping dudes, man. Uh, and actually, like I was not looking forward to doing Slayer, but it ended up being a lot of fun. So once yeah. you got the cannon, yeah, I bought a cannon, dude. Holy shit, your life gets so much better when you have a cannon. Um, also, oh yeah. I don't feel like I'm gonna, I don't feel like, I know in some of the other things we've done, we've read all the quest texts out loud. I ain't gonna do that. I'm just gonna read this shit quietly to myself, because there's a lot of reading in this game, but I actually I like, they, legit they could enjoy do the, voice of, the stories, so. They could do the voice of P.P. Douglas, and we can do the voices of everybody else. That makes perfect sense. <laughs> I'm not gonna Mike, do, do any do voices. <laughs> Mike, do you wanna be this guy? Yeah, sure. You wanna be Velof Hertz? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me do my best. Let me do my best voice. Yeah, One give sec. us your best. Give us your best. Vay laugh hurts. What? That friend? Okay. Well, that's air on it. This is really bad. There's things strange going on in this town, and I suspect the vampires are involved. So, for this quest, I'm already confused. So, like, this whole quest line has been involving like the Meyer Q and defeating the vampires, and it's like all centered around Dark Meyer and Berg Durat. And I'm like. This quest starts in sleep. I have literally never been here before, so I don't even know why the hell this guy's over here. But He's on an investigation. What? He says it right there. You're right. Now, Jacob and Zay, uh -huh. what is a quest point cape? It's once you have all the quests, you get a quest point cape that has a, the coolest animation you've ever seen in your life on it. Okay. It's really cool, is it, man. Is it Basically, purely yeah. cosmetic? Uh, it's got I a sick emote. I think it has stats? I don't remember. I, yeah. It's got some it's, stats, and I think it lets you teleport somewhere. I don't remember where. It's definitely not, like, an Inferno cape, but I, I think it has stats. Maybe. I don't know. Who oh, cares? It's a sleeper plague. Oh, shit. Mike, sometimes you do things not because of the reward you get, but because of the journey of doing it. It's the something. journey. Of, of course. That makes perfect sense. And so you can get a sick emote. Wow, the town of sleep is infected by a disease that makes people fall asleep. That's crazy. Talk about perfect named areas, man. That's what it says. It says that's how the town was okay, named. Okay, I didn't finish reading the last sentence when I started saying it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. now, now, you have a lot of runes in your inventory. Yeah, that's, casting why, that's magics. why it's called RuneScape. You got runes mm -hmm. in it. That's literally just like you I have... teleport to Varrock a billion times. I, I did oh. read ahead for this step of the quest, and I saw there was a boss fight. 
Um, so I got some prayer potions and some swordfish to try and fight that guy with. Now, oh, shit. also worth noting for viewers at home, uh -huh. this is not the native RuneScape client. Zay plays. Zay and Jacob both play in what we would consider a, a super sane client, as it were. It's they very play, strong. Cured. I sure. slap Zay into wanting to play RuneScape and then stop playing it. <laughs> That's pretty <laughs> accurate. It's funny, though, because I think literally everything I know about RuneScape is from Jacob, even though now, compared to me, he's pathetic and weak. So... That's true. Uh, like Jacob's probably never even Jacob, killed Elvark. Jacob made me learn how to do Barrows runs. Jacob taught me about like I forgot something else I was gonna say. Now I don't even remember what it was. Um, using Rune Light in the first place, to be honest. <laughs> um, it's like how the student the student becomes the master or yeah. something because the master decides to do other stuff other than play RuneScape. I want to know more about what, yeah. how, why this guy is here. Yeah, how have things been with this guy recently? Oh yeah, the previous quest, A Taste of Hope. Um, I, guess, I guess I can give some backstory real quick. There's This is Mauritania, which is just, this whole part of the map, it just fucking sucks, is how you would describe it. We got- One big nasty we got swamp. Werewolf Island, Zo Ghost Village, apparently everyone is asleep and sleep. And then everything else is just ruled by vampires and it sucks ass. The whole quest line involving like, this area is killing vampires to try to take back any like livelihood of the humans that live here um and in the previous quest you find out how to kill vampires and you kill and i killed ronis dracon who was like an evil mother effer and now he's a dead evil mfer so did you get a fancy flail for that where's your flail will she need a flail to kill vampires that that will be returning in the future yes you don't oh. need it for this first boss fight so my my d right. simi is better but yeah you need the Fair flail enough. to kill vampires very well um so the thing that's cool about the vampires is you need the flail for two reasons. One, it's like a, a weapon that's blessed by Saradoman, who is like the good god of the setting. But then also it's a flail. It's literally a sickle on a chain attached to a rod that you just flail around because the vampires are immune to normal weapons because they read your mind to know what you're going to do. But they can't read the mind of a flail. It's too crazy to understand. So... That's how you get what hurt them looking, Who's this witch doctor looking MF? Who? Halmalin the Jester or Sister oh, Towen? Yeah, Sister Towen. Well, we don't know What's about her. We're, we're learning from right. Hamelin the Jester right now. We're, learn we're learning about Hamelin the Jester. Of course, one step at a time. He fall ill. Now, the fact that these vampires are only weak to flails, they're considerably stronger than the vampire I'm aware of in RuneScape, Count Draenor, that means, because... <laughs> Count Draenor, you could just fucking Crown kill. Count Draenor actually fucking Draenor's sucks. kind of a chump. I don't, I don't know why he is such a chump compared to all the other vampires. Yeah, he's very easy to kill. Um, bloody when you bloody have a second, Zay, can, can you open the map and just zoom all the way out for me? Uh, okay. Let me finish talking to this guy. Goodbye, Hamlin the Jester. This is as far as you can zoom, but... This map is fucking huge yeah dude yeah this is the I biggest mean, video game of all just... time RuneScape is the biggest video game of all time elden ring ate your heart out this looks elden when ring I... look like elden shit when i think of runescape from my nostalgic years it's like the the road between lumbridge and Varrock. oh yeah totally and that's it's, runescape it's, me. it's like, Varrock. it's yeah, it's, yeah lumbridge map. alcarid yeah a this is Valley. it yeah, man. But man, when you when you unlock the the paid membership, pay to win. That is a gigantic a map. Ooh, do you get to uh, buy a buy a bloody bracer? I think I'm gonna need to get a bloody bracer. Mm, I didn't bring yummy. any coins. Oh fuck. Oh. <laughs> Ninety nine coins. Oh, they're, That's they're ridiculous. Okay. The Cromwick, Cromwick family. family. Come on, dude. If you're gonna fall asleep, you're poisoning them. We all know this. Alright, I'm feel I'm thinking that a vampire is probably the supplier here. Carl. The good conversation of Carl and PP Douglas. Well the legendary hero, PP Douglas. Let me go mm -hmm. ahead and inspect the barrel. Yeah, dude. I'm, I'm so, like the coolest guy of RuneScape, I think, probably. 
when you pitched this series, there were uh -huh. three quests that you wanted to do. No, no, no. There what? were four. Sorry, then, there were then, four. Then that has expanded to five. Um, uh oh. Mm -hmm. And then there's a, a, a re I don't know if you just what you're gonna say, but there's also a secret bonus objective after all the quests are completed, which I think the secret bonus objective might actually be the easiest thing that I have in mind. <laughs> but it was something I've wanted okay. to do with this kid, this game since I was a kid that I never ended up doing. Um, so successfully scam someone, of course. Yeah, for your armature. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? Actually, I should probably not right now. It's really a fucking sick ass cutscene. Looks like. But I can tell my story about getting scammed in this game as a kid, uh, which, since then, I've learned to never trust anyone. A very formative also, moment for Zay. It really was. I also, I just want to know, like, what's the sign? Why is why is Sins of the Father one of the quests to do? What is the sign? Like, what was uh, the? I mean, all, all of these quests are the ones where it's like involves like. I think all these quests are new in old school RuneScape. Don't quote me on yeah. that, but I'm saying I'm I'm 99% sure, and they're all involved like actual boss fights, <laughs> as opposed okay. to Elvar where you left click on it and stand around and wait. Oh fuck! Is this a stealth Whoa. quest? Oh fuck, dude. Let's not That's shit good. talk the Elvar fight. The Elvar fight is surprisingly challenging. Elvar might be one of the hardest <laughs> bosses in video game history, frankly. Yeah, that's we'll correct. Let him see him. Follow Carl Hyman just when he turns around. You think I got time to make it to here? I'm going for yeah, it. Yeah, dude, run, 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 run. This is gonna be a yeah. bad quest. You got like a you got like a door line of sight. Perfect. There are some this really is a bad quests mission. in this game, man. Like Mornings End Part Two has this part where it's like this like it, I think using the quest helper, I feel like quest uh, helper Carl. I got away. This is this is gonna be a fun one. Um, <laughs> Mornings End Part Two has this thing where it's like a oh god, this is so fast. Um, a reflected light puzzle like it's a fairly generic idea for a puzzle but it's in a cave where you're being attacked by enemies literally non-stop and it's like probably 50 steps to solve the puzzle fully even using the quest helper okay. i think it took me like two hours to do this quest it was man these, there are some bad quests in here these lines that are on the map right now these are quest helper lines right this is oh, some yeah. rune light shit Big okay yeah. okay just shows you, so shows I you guess, where to go I guess just I have to follow get out him. of cover, though. Yeah, because, I mean, I got yeah. blasted he's, he's, before. She must not turn around for a minute or something. Like, it must give you the time right, go, go, go. to get behind that. I think we got to trust oh. the lines. Uh -oh. I think you're good. I'm, I'm trusting the lines. Wow, he can't yeah, see me, we, guys. I'm so well yeah, hidden. We, I'm invisible We got to trust right the there. lines. All right, yeah, so he's got to follow him closer. You just I, might, there's this the, you might be able to, like, run beside. Oh, man. Oh, man. Huff, puff, puff, puff. Okay, you make it? Good. You good? I'm hoping so. All right, we're good. Oh I'm my I'm, I'm god! Just, I'm just going on. I'm going on the tile where the blue line goes and hoping it works out. So yeah, far, so yeah, good. yeah, yeah. That's the plan. Um, fuck, what was I gonna say? Oh, there was another stealth quest, rat catchers, that took me like probably hours to do as well. So I'm pretty intimately. F what the fuck? He's going so far. Pretty intimately familiar with the stealth quests of RuneScape. Oh my god, I don't think I get there. Oh, I think you're good. Oh. Oh yeah, you're good. Was, you're good. Nice. Close. That Safe. Close. That's the most hidden your guy has been. I'm basically invisible. Also, bright red armor maybe not the play for stealth. <laughs> no, it's fine. Do you think? What the fuck? What the fuck? Uh oh, uh oh, this uh -oh. is this uh -oh. is this is funny shit. Okay, okay, we got we got to the finish oh, line. Thank okay. God. Nice. Ooh. That's that's classic RuneScape the to me. Carl. Is the, the path, eh? What are you hiding down here, oh, Carl? It's time to kill Croy. So I will tell you on my other monitor, I do have the RuneScape wiki open, and I do know that this guy mm -hmm. does both magic and physical attacks, so I would be praying magic against Croy. That a damn vampire, man. Look at him. He does look like a vampire. He As a group, like a we've snake, watched- Dude, what's wrong with him? We've watched both Blade and Blade 2 recently, so yeah, we got a lot of vampire lore. You're a fool, Carl. Oh shit, dude, this Croy guy's up to no good. Go back to your pub, Earl. I think I'm gonna need to kill Croy pretty soon. Wow, Carl. Okay, I think he didn't look so to the stupid. left. <laughs> <laughs> Carl genuinely fucking sucks at his job. <laughs> Man, strong clouds. Oh 
Stay Armstrong tuned. Plus. All right, then, Damien. I don't know who Damien is. I don't think I've met this guy before. That's Damien. Uh, yeah, I mean, I want I you to meet Croy. That. Look at the wretched thing, it's, Damien. It's barely even a proper juvenile. There's some, like, charming timelessness to the cutscenes in old school RuneScape. I like how this game looks. Dude, this game actually owns. That's complete sincerity. RuneScape kicks ass. I mean, they had a look, yeah. and they decided to just, like, lean full into it instead of trying yeah. to change it. Trying to, like, make it better. Yeah. It's endearing in its own right. Oh, this guy caused the sleeper plague. What an evil yeah, boy. why? Because oh, while they sleep, they, they tie them. Slurp, slurp, slurp their blood up. Sleepers yeah, okay. only need the fraction of the blood of normal human needs. Wait, oh, oh, pretty clever. Oh, Vantron's pissed. Are any of these characters you've met before? Or are yes, Vantron, Vantron Klaus is a, the recurring villain of the plotline, basically. Um, okay. It's the, the, you meet the Meyer Q, which is the group that I'm working for, like, against the vampires. Like, he basically tasks you to find them, and then you find out later on he's a vampire, and he comes in and kills a bunch of them. And since then, he's been kind of like the recurring villain. Okay. If I remember right, I think the, the general idea of the plot line is like, this guy makes you find the Myrki, who are the human resistance to the yes. vampires, because the, the vampires let the humans live there, but they, like, blood tie them. Yes. We're, I, we will be Meyer going to Berg the Rot. We will be going to Berg the Rot and Meyer Ditch at some point during this questline, I'm sure, and you will see how shitty it is for humans to live in Mauritania right now. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm looking forward to that, because in my mind... I mean, if you could just, like, give them a little bit of your blood and they didn't have to suck it out of you, I mean, that's not, like, that's not the end of the world. You 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 will regret your words and deeds when you see Meyer Ditch, dude. <laughs> I, okay, because right now, in my mind, I would rather give the government a little bit of my blood than <laughs> my money off my paycheck. Just yeah. I'm just saying that. I'm hoping I don't break anything. I don't want to take off. I want to hide this max hit thing that I have in room light. Real quick. There we go. It's so good to see your guy just walk into the cutscene in his. Hello, it's me, P.P. Douglas. Look how cool the mustache. This boy looks though, man. Holy shit, yeah, Croy! I love the mustache. Death, Death is not on my to do <laughs> list today. Oh man. What a badass I'm line. So cool. The Joker. Learned, learned all his lines from Blade too. Not as it. All right, bro. I didn't. I'm not. Uh, I need to switch to my pray, oh, uh, uh, pray magic. Here we go. It's fun. The punching. battle is on. Battle Our on. first it's taste good, of good. combat. Oh yeah. Dang. I'm shredding, dude. And this guy's getting Look ripped. Oh yeah. my god. You should hide He's the hide the side pan. It's gonna make it more cinematic. Oh, so true. There we go. Oh yeah. Nice. Get in now there. we're getting. Yeah, get him. Get oh, in perfect. There. there we go. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> this is part of getting a good camera angle. Now we're gaming. Epic battle. Oh, he did a lot, a lot of damage to me just now. Or maybe that was the first spell and I wasn't paying attention. A strange potion weakens you, what the hell? He's, he's just like punching you in the head. It doesn't look like he's doing any magic, but I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. I, he can do both. I mean, he did cast a spell right away, didn't he? Before yeah, but you weren't like next magic. to him, now you're... Oh, there you go. Well, I guess, is that magic? Oh, he yeah, okay. He, he looks, like, looks, like he does, looks like he does whatever you're not praying. So there you go. Do, go ahead and pray some more magic. You know what? Flash him. I'm gonna need a sword just to be safe. One of the cool things about RuneScape is that no matter what the item is, you always need to cut off the like second syllable and call it an E. So it's like it's not a swordfish. That's stupid. It's a swordy. It's a swordy. Yeah, that makes sense. It's kind of it's kind of a cool thing. This guy's so done. Fucker, don't throw potions at me. He throw like a potion at you? Yeah. Yeah. What? He's throwing potions. A blood vial? There we go. Toasted. Easy. What an epic well, that's battle. him dealt with. She destroys the tab. I will be pulling back up the quest helper, though, as we go. That Just was a. Uh... Turn my prayer off for me, okay. That was an I, easy yeah. example of RuneScape <laughs> combat. You didn't really have to do anything there. Here's some more no. RuneScape combat. Oh, there you yeah. go. I, so, little spoiler for the rest of the. Wait, how the fuck do I get out of here? Is there a... Do I have a. Go the other way. Where the hell am I? 
There. Yeah. Okay, it looks like it's south. Okay. Let's um, go. Uh, yeah, go south. The boss fight at the end of this quest is going to be very powerful. This is a master level quest, but people say that this boss fight is like the hardest of all the quest bosses. So. Very exciting. Only the best content for our viewers at home. Hey Mike, can we get your classic uh, Veloth voice again? Oh god. Yeah, for sure. Click her line. Alright. Uh, excellent work, friend! This should stop any new cases of the illness! That's exactly what I thought it would sound like when I looked at him. Yeah. It's perfect. And, and that's exactly, definitely the same voice I did the first time, because I didn't forget. A hundred percent. Yeah. They did the sleeper plague to take the blood ties. Doing a little lore dump. Remember all that stuff that those guys said two seconds ago? Well, here it is again. Huh. Weird. It's surprising that they have a human village and people are just like, yeah, I mean, they seem like they're actually kind of pogged up in whatever this town's called, I already forgot. Sleep. Even more blood than normal. Oh, shit. Hmm. Well, I'll put us end to that by killing lots of vampires, I'm sure. That's the perfect plan. If you kill all of- kill enough vampires, they won't need as much blood. It all works out. Circle of life. This guy's a human, right? Yeah. yeah. He's the leader this guy's of, a the, member of the resistance. Of the Canifus Oh, view. this is the leader. He's wielding a sickle. Yeah, it's been blessed. The silver enchanted sickle. That makes sense. I was watching a uh, critically acclaimed television show Game of Thrones yesterday, and uh -huh. uh, there were some people fighting with the, the big sickle style weapons in it. The, um, you know, the fucking Riders of Rohan, whatever they're called. Uh, the ones that Daenerys leads. Uh, and I was thinking to myself, that's a pretty cool weapon that you don't see a lot of in the old fantasy. The big curved blade. Fair enough. Yeah, there's Amorakians, so they can eat my ass. Alright. Off to Paterdomus. So the Paterdomus is like a enchant is like a chapel on the river Salve, which divides Mist Island from Mauritania, and the vampires can't cross it because it was uh, the waters are blessed by Saradolman. Just a little backstory. Yeah, Saradolman's yeah. a a god, right? A prayer yeah, god. He's the he's thing? the good guy god. He's the good guy. Yeah. Great white fire lighters. Yeah, take them. Free loot. No, I don't. I don't bother with that. Crap. I got look at look how loaded I am, dude. I'm stacked. I do. Are you dual Android wielding? Burn. Uh, no, I'm using my D Simi and a D Defendi. D kinda. Defendi, that's what it is. Okay. It's a, it. it's a, oh, wait, oh shit, I think with my rod is blessing. Like a, like a Sorry, dagger looking shield? Blessy. Yeah. Um, yeah, like it a, gives you like a, a, increases yeah. your damage and accuracy stuff. Cool. It's like a little sword you, you hold in your shield slot. Jacob, you're gonna go crazy like when you see this shit when I got in my house. You're gonna go nuts. Check this All right, out. I'm ready, I'm prepared to go nuts. Holy shit. Did I go nuts too early? Yeah. Oh my god. Boom. Whoa. Why do you just have a, now we're in why do you have a portal to Cannabis? Uh, one of the hard Mauritania diary things was to build a portal to Cannabis, and I'm like, you know, that would actually be useful, so you don't need to take this fairy ring all the time. So, um, two reasons why I have So, them. okay, so fairy rings, one form of fast travel. You can clearly have portals in your home. That's another form of fast travel. Oh, who are all these guys? Oh, is that you the... can't. Oh, these are like the mercenaries. That, like you, like get to come help out against the, uh, um, the bad boys. Yes. Yeah. Oh, you know what? This is a uh, this is temple trekking the reverse direction. This would lead them to Bergdorot instead of away, so that way they can oh. go and fight the vampires. Hmm. I've done one temple trek ever, and it, I, literally I had zero obstacles. I just clicked, escort the guy. Yep. Waited five seconds. Here's your reward. It was great. I loved that. Did, that's how good of a job you did, dude. I didn't really have beaten here, dude. He walked. There's no mounts in RuneScape, right? No. Hell no. Okay. There's only okay. there's teleporting and there's running. Yeah, yeah, of course. And that's how we like it. And wa and walking. And when you walking. run out of running.
strange happenings. Yeah, I forget what the quest it was. I think it was in A Taste for Hope. Some of the werewolves managed to cross the river south. We don't know how, and they were oh. kidnapping people to take their blood. Oh, that seems bad. Yeah. He's like, jump, right? Probably just like, jump. Just like, jump the river. The river's no, magic. I mean, the vampires could have. It's, like, it's like a magic they, barrier. If that was the issue, yeah. Oh, okay. You're, it's got a, it's got sort of a vertical height. Yeah. Like, magic wise, understood. Actually, the the first quest you do to get into Mauritania involves you getting tricked into destroying uh, the barrier in the river and having to fix it. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah, that was another quest where this guy. Uh, the king of Varrock was going to send over, like, an army to kill the vampires, but Aeonisig was like, Guthix wouldn't like that, you shouldn't do it, and he's like, alright, I won't, uh, sorry. Fine. Yeah, Guthix, no, me another, too. Me too, another Vela. god? Yes, Guthix is, like, the god of balance, and he's like, you shouldn't do a good thing, because that means that you have to do something bad to balance it out. Stuff That's like that. so true. Okay, so we got Sarah Doman, good guy god. Guthix, yep. neutral god. And then evil god... Zamorak. Zamorak. Zamorak, yes. Yes, 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 of course. The three gods. Oh no, the haunted woods. I forget who Ivan is. <laughs> you forgot about Ivan? Yeah. He's just a boy. He's a boy, I'm hearing. A grown man boy. He's a grown man boy. He's a grown man, Velaf. He's been with the Meyer Cube, I'm learning. Must be this guy's son or something, I'm betting. Oh, he's the last in his bloodline. Oh. So the weapon I use that can kill vampires is the Ivanda's Flail. So. Okay. I've been pre I don't know about the Seven Priests and Warriors. No. I've learned about them a few months ago. Yeah, but I didn't. <laughs> There were seven There's priestly seven warriors. They, they did war against the vampires, and then... Uh, I don't know, I guess they died or something, probably. There's a statue of them over there, funny. actually. Oh, that's those guys. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All dead, yeah. I assume. The Vantrom killing Sonny and Harold. That was the that was the first time like you were really introduced to the IRQ and Vantrom. After Vantrom tricked okay. you into finding their base for him, basically. Surprising amount of lore in runescape runescape is a very lore heavy game like surprisingly it actually, it actually kicks ass though is the thing I one of the quests they it. added after they started old school right this, this was only one, like a yeah. year or two old didn't it yeah it came out in 2019 i believe oh wow very new What is he stupid? He doesn't realize that his name is the same name, but without this. Without this what? Oh fuck! <laughs> Hang on, I just. Well, this doesn't chat. You know, just to be safe. Let's just get rid of that. <laughs> um, <laughs> just, just put a sensor bar over that. One of the things that's actually really nice though about like getting high level in RuneScape is you can. Get, like, I did it at the beginning of the video without saying anything about it, but I hopped to the fifteen hundred skill total world. So that means there won't be any spammers in the GE anytime we go there. Because anywhere else you off. go. No, sometimes you have to see what? that people are saying, like, race up at this and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's part of the that's, experience of playing an online game. That's what, that's what RuneScape is about. It's part of the about. experience. Wave one, rainbow, okay, slur. Like Where word, one. yeah. Yeah. Ivan Strom. There he is. There's Ivan Strom. P.P. Douglas, so good to see you. This guy just been hanging guy, out here this whole time? This guy went to the Zay School of Stealth, re having his hood up so he's not recognized, but wearing bright <laughs> red. Oh. I've seen time. The way this shot is shot makes me think like someone's going to get sniped here in a second. <laughs> <laughs> Analyzing the RuneScape camera angles to predict a future death. It's called uh, cinematography, Mike. Maybe you've heard of it. Ivan is for sure gonna die. 
Uh oh. I told you. Uh -oh. I told you someone was gonna get sniped. Oh, yeah, uh -oh. you were. You were right. Those are the werewolves. Whoa. You can tell because they're cool as so. hell. The werewolf models actually pretty good. That's yeah. not bad. I think this must be like a new portrait because it seems like the animation quality is too high for it to be like. It's way better. Stories. Yeah, <laughs> maybe they, they might have gone through and like redone the werewolves recently or something. <laughs> They should let you be a werewolf. There were no Dracon. Oh. Yeah, I did that. What's what's Dracon protection? He's just saying that that doesn't mean anything. Like you like your family name doesn't mean anything. Oh, got it. Okay. Little Damien has been a very naughty boy. Oh yeah. Uh oh. I think all these people are about to die. Oh yeah, I like that the were werewolves are getting giving these guys shit. Was one of the Hang quests on, yeah. before this one you inventing a way to kill vampires? Yeah, that's that wasn't a taste for hope. That's what I said before. The Avanda's flail is a, is that the way sense. to kill them. Also, I just oh, scored okay. the check in the in the quest helper, and I do see that one of the enemies to defeat is Damien Lucerte or whatever. So Ooh, a little little <laughs> foreshadowing. So is there like so? Obviously, there's some kind of weird alliance between the vampires and the werewolves, but it seems sketchy to me. It seems like maybe they don't want to be friends. Looks like the uh, the werewolves are giving blood to the vampires, but they don't yeah. want to. As they long don't as want to. As long as you as long as your city tights of the amount of blood they need to the vampires, the vampires are chill with you essentially. Okay. Uh oh. The scary noises. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, shit. you've been found. Whoa. Oh no. Holy shit. Oh my gosh. Oh, you're getting blasted. Dude. I've been rooted for 12 seconds. You've been rooted. Wait, just wait, just put, let the just let it run out. Just don't advance the quest text until it runs out. <laughs> oh, okay. Why would you attack us then if you were here to talk? <laughs> Why would you open with your like opening salvo <laughs> barrage move? Well, I just wanted to make sure you knew her strongest moves. This is Vanessa Dracon. She's the sister to Lorne Old Dracon, just so you guys know. Oh, and no, Ron Stragon, who, who I killed. Yeah. P.P. Douglas, the great vampire slayer. Every, many people are saying this. <laughs> <laughs> I spat on my monitor on accident. <laughs> <laughs> I could spit on mine in purpose. In solidarity. In purpose? Yeah, if you want. On purpose. Offer. Ooh, or in purpose. I, lo I love to get. I love to get once in a lifetime offers. Ooh, what a deal! Ooh. Well, she Mysterious. seems trustworthy. <laughs> I seen the graveyard. Gather your whole resistance organization yeah. and meet me there. <laughs> <laughs> I will not bring a blood bomb, I promise. Oh shit, that's where our base is, by the way. Oh. Uh, the rock basement. Okay, maybe she's not lying then. Sit up. I don't remember that guy. <laughs> well, apparently he's the he's the leader of the Meyer Key. Or First the, I've heard of is a town, right? It's the Meyer Key is the group. Yes. <laughs> you are not kidding, but there being a lot of reading in these quests. Yeah, dude. This isn't good. Uh oh. 
How many Meyer key are there? Like five or six? I think there's like five or six. Yeah, the, most <laughs> of these quests involve there like, being like eight of them, and then by the end of the quest, there's like two left. <laughs> And this guy was lying about how many other ones there were. Are you like a formal member of the Meyer key? I think you get inducted to them, yeah. I don't remember, but I think so. Okay. It's sort of a brave adventurer type. He's a, he's a member of every group. Yeah, pretty yeah. much. As you can tell, I'm in the Legends Guild. If you can tell by my awesome cape. Sick cape. Oh my god, he's so cool. I might get that Myth's cape, actually. Oh, no, it's Legends, okay. Look out, a ghost. Uh, she's just chilling. All right. Literally, I can't even see what type of ghost it is. Yeah, Spooky. it's just a normal ass ghost. A true <laughs> ghost. The regular kind. Ivan is for sure gonna die in this quest. Oh, or Velioff is gonna die and Ivan is gonna have to rise to his bloodline and take over the leadership of the higher Q. That's probably what's gonna happen. I'm betting, I'm betting it's that one. Breaking bread with a vampire. What have we come to? Yeah. Yeah. I'll fuck her up. Radagad. Pulmafi. Sophalon. So Sophalon, wow. I do remember. He's Sophalon is the leader of the Meyer Ditch Meyer Q. You know him well. Oh, okay. Exactly. A specific sect, as it were. So I think we're gonna do a temple trek here, it looks like, probably. Like to get back? Yeah. Ooh, extra, extra content. All right, I'm gonna grab some food then real quick at the bank since I dropped it all off a minute ago. Oh. And it looks like I'm gonna need the Avantis Flail. I think I might need it for the rest of the quest, so I'm probably just gonna drop my scimitar, I think. I'm not drop it. Pick up the good old the flail? Bank. Yeah, drop it yeah. on the floor, let somebody else have it. Looks like I'm gonna need to kill need some nail beasts. That's kind of scary. Yeah, I'm reading through your quest, your future quest objectives. Oh yeah, actually, I'm reading it now, and it just looks like you only need the flail later on, and the flail kind of sucks ass. So bring it with you though, can't you? It actually, has decent attack bonuses, but at minus twenty four uh, melee strength is not good. But yeah, I'm just gonna. Is this go with me. is this a plugin that like lets you like filter your gear no, you in your bank? On, you just click on search. I just I have never. I, I didn't notice the bank tabs at the top that had like uh, tabs for like fish runes. That kind you of can stuff. like you like make your oh, own. Oh, this. Tabs. I, I, yeah, I've set all this up. This is. I just was. This is how I started oh, things. Oh, got it. That's cool. Um, is there anything else? No, I just said the flail and combat gear and food. All right. 